Hi guys, in this video I am going to discuss about how to add multiple types of objects to an array list. So this is the example to add multiple types of objects using array list. So first I am going to execute and show you the output first. So add here, first is integer type id, here a string type name and here integer is. So here this is the object here I created employees. So here I have taken one employees of class. So add here this is the static tag and here you can see the output add here 101 than 28 like this values. Now here after I am going to explain this code. So this code pasted here. So if you develop the code, control comes to main method here after that for inside. So add here there is the one clause. Add here employee s1 and here new employee and here I passed 100 then and 28. Now here after here this is the object that I created. Now here after there is a one or definition already written of employees or class. So uh, here this is employee s1 is the object. Now here after directly add here from here control move to this point. At this point and here that coincide. So add here integer id is a string name. So add here id. So this value is now received 101 next than is 28 so that coincide so right here id value go to this dot id name value go to this dot name and here is that go to this dot name so right here id name as id name as so it belongs to here so about the this keyword that i already discussed so after done this all those things now control back to this point and here this is the things now here after s1 part done like this that brings the process of s2 100 to billing 27 s3 object of reply this values now here after the next is one by one that going to add here array list employee a1 is the object new array list so if you don't give add here so it will take automatically add here size now here after it will add add here a1 dot add so when is the object i list employee so add add here s1 values 100 this all and here s2 100 billing s3 this all now here after the next is here for i will start from zero and here a1 has three element so add here the size is three now here after i 0 0 less than 3 condition to that coincide so at here this time they will get i value so i value is now 0 and here id so first time that id is the 101 or uh, it will display now here after name than 28 now here after i is now increase i is 1 here 1 less than 3 condition to so this time at here 100 to billing 27 that display. Now here after 2 to less than 3 condition 2. So next time at 103 here 26 display. And if the value of i is now 3, so it will automatically or get from the for loop and next that also name matter. So this is the way we can achieve at here multiple or types of object plan array list. So I hope guys this video is helpful for you. So now in this video is over. So thanks for watching. See you next video.